question we've got a lot coming in on is related to histamines, histamine intolerance, uh, how that relates to gut health. Any thoughts on that, Dr. Rawls? Right. Um, mast cell sensitivity. Um, you know, it, it's your typical allergic reaction. Your body has different pathways. You know, our, our immune system is very, very complex, and it's been dealing with a myriad of threats over thousands of years. Um, so there are different pathways. Uh, one pathway in the immune system is, is uh, it, when, when, when microbes like the ones that we find with Lyme disease, uh, they, they work by infecting cells and infecting white blood cells. So part of the immune system is targeting cells that have, my, that have been infected by microbes or, or just gone bad, that they're cancerous cells. Other parts of the immune system are targeting worms. Other parts are targeting extracellular bacteria like pneumonia. Others are targeting food allergens. Um, so what happens, and I think this is just part of the chronic illness, chronic Lyme thing, is when you have these microbes in your system, in your tissues, they are manipulating the immune system. They infect white blood cells and they manipulate the immune system to shift attention away from them. So it's called a classic, the, the TH1 response is, uh, and it's a little bit more complicated than this. This is a bit simplified, but um, that TH1 response is the part of the immune system that's targeting the, uh, the microbes that infected uh, cells. So the microbes are pushing the immune system away from that toward other things. And what they're pushing it toward is more of an allergic type reaction that's affecting mast cells and activating histamine. Plus, on top of that, you've got all these leaky, these proteins that are leaking across the gut that are activating the immune system and activating that part of the immune system. So we become very histamine sensitive. And this gets into what we call epigenetics. Um, the epigenetics is, is uh, the study of environmental factors and how they affect our genes, how they turn on bad genes and turn off good genes. And so that's what's happening in this process of chronic illness and leaky gut and everything else is we're turning on genes that are turning on abnormal parts of our immune system that cause us to be more, more reactive to things that we shouldn't be. So we get an exaggerated histamine response.